Hello, today I'm excited to be joined by two industry leaders in financial technology. With us are Paul Chang, Head of Payment Networks at AWS, and Pahal Patangia, Head of Business Development for Payments at NVIDIA. Welcome, Paul and uh, Pahal. And I'd like to start with you, Paul. At Money 2020 in Las Vegas, NVIDIA announced an innovative AI workflow for fraud detection that's available on AWS. Could you walk us through what makes this solution unique and more importantly, what are the benefits it can offer to financial institutions and how can it be seamlessly integrated into the existing infrastructures? Sure, Effie. You know, financial losses from worldwide credit card transaction fraud are expected to reach $43 billion by 2026. So really what we're working with NVIDIA is this AI workflow for fraud detection running on Amazon Web Services, which can help combat this burgeoning epidemic using accelerated data processing and advanced algorithms to improve AI's ability to detect and prevent credit card transaction fraud. Uh, we're basically working with businesses to help them embrace machine learning tools and strategies that can observe up to 40% improvement in fraud detection and accuracy, boosting their ability to identify and stop fraudsters faster and mitigate harm. The way we look at it is there's different parts as part of the fraud transaction prevention workflow. What we're partnering to do is really modernize the transaction fraud prevention flow with optimal price and performance infrastructure to accelerate a few things, data processing, improving model training and feature engineering, and improving real-time model inferencing. So using these solutions, the benefits of AWS along with NVIDIA GPUs and AI software libraries with minimal code changes to really accelerate the data processing feature engineering, the model training, and the model inference. On top of that, we're also leveraging things like graph databases, large language models, and graph neural networks to also increase the fraud detection rate. Bahal, from NVIDIA's perspective, how is accelerated computing revolutionizing fraud detection in financial services? I'd love to hear from you the role of these GNNs, the graphic neural networks, in all this transformation and how it helps reducing the false positives and improving the accuracy that Paul was talking about compared to approaches, I guess the traditional ones. And, and what are these innovations bringing to the table and how are they expected to evolve? Absolutely. And Paul outlined it really well that this is a huge problem amounting to $43 billion annual losses. And every part of this process is compute intensive, is data intensive, is time sensitive. And hence, it is super important that accelerated computing, which is a combination of hardware, software, and the optimizations that come into play, put customers in the best position to leverage these capabilities. So think of processing huge amounts of data using GPU accelerated Spark within AWS environment, and ultimately making predictions in near real time. That's why algorithms like graph neural networks, algorithms like transformers have been crucial in understanding the nuances and the patterns which are present in the data so that more weeds, more anomalies could be weeded out and you could have a proactive approach to fighting fraud rather than a reactive one, which was the traditional tools-based methods. So that is where we are moving. The data sizes are moving. The model complexities are moving. And at the same time, the customers need near real-time predictions at the cost of making sure that false positives are reduced to a minimum. And accelerated computing powered by NVIDIA platform on AWS is the way to go when you think about the next frontiers of fraud detection. Yeah, and the only thing to add to that, Effie, is historically the payment industry has known GPUs for model training and model inference. Uh, what we're really trying to showcase here as well is that GPUs are excellent for acceleration for data processing and feature engineering. In fact, in our own internal testing, in partnership with NVIDIA and their engineers, what we saw for data processing and model training together was we were able to do it 14 times faster and eight times cheaper on GPUs versus uh, CPUs. 
Um, and what we really loved about the NVIDIA AI stack on AWS is that you're able to take a data set, run it through their qualification tool, identify if it's ideal for GPU acceleration. That's one. The second part is that they provide a set of libraries to easily allow you to go from programming languages that go from CPUs to GPUs through a library change rather than having to code it entirely yourself. Do you have some specific uh, examples in financial services that are already using these AI workflows to combat fraud and the kind of results that they are seeing? Yeah, one of the great examples is Bank, a digital bank based on Europe, leveraging accelerated computing on AWS and NVIDIA platform to help fight fraud effectively. They saw increased data processing by 5x uh, in terms of acceleration. And when it came to training these complex models, they were able to see 100x acceleration. They were able to reduce the false positive rate by two and a half times than what was there before accelerated computing came into the game. So that's really a great unlock and tells about the capability of how this full stack play, getting accelerated computing, getting embedded into fraud detection pipelines is a game changer for every financial services institution. Yeah, in terms of what just Pahal just mentioned, right? So we really measure in terms of fraud detection by several metrics. That includes fraud approval rates, fraud rates, but another important metric is false positives, right? So if you look at the typical average, it could be 20 to one or 15 to one. That means for every 20 declined transactions made by the banks, they are catching one fraudulent transaction, right? That is a lot of transactions declined to catch like one fraudulent transaction. So to us, we're constantly looking to improve the customer experience. And in this particular example, uh, leveraging uh, in NVIDIA AI on AWS, uh, they were able to reduce that down to eight to one. Uh, that's a much better customer experience and so we're working as an industry to obviously increase approval rates, reduce fraud rates, and also reduce the false positives, right? Because you don't want to be declined when you're looking to make a legitimate transaction. Excellent. In my mind, it's very clear that the future of fraud prevention lies in scalable and adaptive AI solutions that can really evolve fast and learn uh, how to deal with threats uh, that are evolving and, and combat them. Thank you very much, uh, Paul and Pahal. Thank you, Abby, Thanks, Abby, for having us.